Hello, welcome to my first ever tutorial. I'll be teaching you guys how to install your Counter-Strike Source skins that you download from any website that has skin packs or skins in general. I'm going to do an op, so you go down to um, download. Click on any link that's closest to you, but since this is only one, just going to click here. Now, you got to go to your hard drive, program files. Go down to Valve or Steam, depending on if you downloaded or bought a game. Then you go to Steam Apps, then your username, which you should be obvious to, Counter Strike Source, and C Strike, and then click Save. Uh, this is going to be wild. I want to make a point that the best thing to use is WinRAR, since it extracts easier and you can extract both RAR files, which is RAR, or you can extract zip files. Um, Downloads almost done. Sometimes it's fast, sometimes it's slow. It depends on the size of the file and the uh, amount of memory it takes up. So, since this is a 15 megabyte skin, it'll take a little while. Now, when it's done, you open the folder, go down to the RAR file, extract into the C Strike folder. Now this skin is going to have multiple fo folders you can use, so I'm going to just go with a basic, I'm going to go with the good old American flag skin. See all those different skins. Now go to materials, models, and then you go down to what is called uh, v, v models or something to that extent. You cut the file, that the folder that's inside of that one, the V one go up to the materials in your C strike folder which should be there and then go to repeat the process you got down to that one folder the V folder then you just paste the file that the folder that you cut go back to your C strike folder now this this would be much easier but since I have so much skins already installed in here I have to go down to basic everything so go back to that go to W this time, cut the folder in there, don't worry about the files, just cut the folder. Go back up to the materials, go to the, to the W inside of the materials folder through the models, and paste. Next we're going to do the straight down to the V GUI under the materials and the models go down to the folder right above the actual file for the GUI or you can just take that take the actual file itself, go back up to materials in your C strike folder go to the V GUI in your materials folder and paste the best thing to do is just to memorize where your folders are, how many you went down to the actual folder that it's packed now we're going to do models, take all the files in the models, cut, go to the models in your C strike folder, go to the weapons, and paste. Let's see, there you go, there's all the files you just cut. Next we're going to do scripts, which I I believe this is the first time I've ever done scripts for it. Just we're gonna cut the actual notepad. Go back to your C strike folder. There should be a scripts folder somewhere in there. Depending on what kind of servers you played in. Cut, paste it, put it into your uh folder with your weapons, where other ones would be. Now we're gonna do sounds. Just simple put weapons in to your weapons sounds okay, I'm gonna cut both I'm gonna paste into my sounds folder which is also in your C strike folder pretty basic once you get used to it now we're just gonna run test it see how well it works see if it worked or not gonna go load up Counter Strike Source just gonna go to a basic map create your own server do whatever you want yeah, it takes a little while for it to load up for me. There we go. This is my uh, this little creative server. Just joined on any team. Since I did a op skin, 
it should be under the rifles go down to the very bottom and there you go that is how you install your skins hope you have a good day and install as many skins as you want this is Vic13036 signing out have a good day